Shalawan. Shabbat Shalawan. Well, what time is it? Go to Shabbat over with the sunset. All right, Shalawan. Before I start, call Haloyim, Wahawadla, Yahawah, Bahashim, Yahawah Shai, Wahara, call Quraj. Rakata Yahawah, Rakata Yahawah Shai, Yahawah Bashim Yahawah Shai, Brak Yah. Double honor to the apostle Nels, Shalawan. To the Akim, Shalawan, to the Akwathi. This is Aki live now with another video. This is Dory's last day is five. And I'm about to get into the scriptures. This is a touchy subject. You know, thank these uh, Babylonians, these, you know, these American, these American people don't want to hear that the most high hates, man. And we're about to go into it. And uh, you know, and I wanted to say the most high true name is Yahweh, which means he exists, he to be. And the only begotten son true name is Yahweh Shai, which means he deliver or he say who he delivering his people only. Nobody else, you know what I'm saying? Nobody else, okay? So we're gonna get this right here because this is a touchy subject. And this is what those so-called pastors in those churches. This, this, this is what they pass up. They don't read you. They don't read you. They don't read you everything, man. It's probably six. 16. These six things thou the Lord hate. Alright? Now all the time, all the time I was in these churches, I never heard this not one time in no church I've ever been in. None of these so-called churches, these buildings these people go to, I never heard this not one time in them. At all, you know what I'm saying? So this would it say. These six things don't the Lord hate, yea, seven are an abomination unto him. All right? A proud look, a lying tongue, and hands that shed innocent blood. Now, who around here shed an innocent blood, man? All right? I ain't got to point no elbows. I ain't got to point no fingers. You already know, because they caught red-handed. All right? The so-called white man. And we do... When you look into him, he's the Edomites of the Bible. Alright? That is the true biblical nationality. Esau, Adumian. Alright? The Adumians. That's the Greek way of saying Edomites. Alright? Adawam means red in Hebrew. That's what they are. They're not white. You know what I'm saying? They're red. They're the real red man. You know what I'm saying? So they're around here shedding innocent blood all over the planet. Alright? And guess what? Their time is running out. We're in the last seconds of this. They're about to be out of rulership, man. And we're about to be in. Um, you know what I'm saying? So it says, uh, so the Lord hates, man. All right? These six things thou the Lord hate. Ye, yea, seven are an abomination unto him. A proud look, a lying tongue, and hands that shed innocent blood, and heart that devises wicked imaginations, feet that be swift and running to mischief, a false witness that speaketh lies, and he that showed discord among brethren. All right, this is all in the scriptures. Now, I never heard this all those times I've been going to church since I was younger. I never heard none of this. All I heard was prosperity doctrine, you know, give tithes, hooping and hollering, catching the Holy Ghost. And the same thing on Wednesday, then Sunday again, then Wednesday and Sunday again. The same thing, you never learned nothing there, man. But when the Lord open your understanding, get you teachers, apostles and elders, brothers that teach you, now you learn and you do the same thing. It's repetitive all the way until your house shy come back, you heard me? But the most high hates, man. So it just told you what he hate right here. So let me get let me get some more, because this smack cold. I ain't bring a jacket. <laughs> I need to I need to get prepared up here, man. I need to learn the areas and learn when it, you know, how how cold it get up here, man, because it gets smack cold. I might not be shivering right now, but it's freezing, man. It's smack cold. So if I start stuttering or I fumble, please forgive me. All right, hold on. No, I'm not going to get that yet. Matter of fact, let me get Romans right quick. Romans 9. Romans 9, 13, as it is written. Jacob have I loved, but Esau have I hated. 
As it is written, Jacob have I love, and Jacob is you 12 tribes of Israel, you so-called Negroes, Latinos, Native Americans, so-called Puerto Ricans, so-called West Indians, Seminole Indians, so-called uh, Jamaicans, so-called Mexicans, etc. All right, the Lord love you, man. And the Lord hate, you know, you so-called white people. Esau, you all right? These Russians, the hillbilly Joe Jack Jericho, you know what I'm saying? These Romans. These Greeks, <laughs> he hate these people, man. So the Lord hates Yahweh. And when you see it in all, you see the Lord, when you see Lord in all caps, it's talking about the Heavenly Father, Yahweh. All right? That's who he's talking about. When he said he loved a particular people and he hate, let me read it again. Romans 9, 13, as it is written, Jacob have I loved, but Esau have I hated. What shall we say then? Is there unrighteousness with the Most High? God forbid, man. Matter of fact, let me get a precept to that because I see it right here. Malachi, hold on, where's that? Malachi, Malachi 1 and 2. Malachi, yeah. Malachi. And this, these, these people are so butthurt at the scriptures, man. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> they don't want these scriptures to come out. You know, that's why they trying to railroad us, jump us, stab us, shoot us, beat us up, etc. They don't want to hear these words, but look, you don't got no wants, man. You're going to hear these words regardless. All right? Come on, Malachi. So, the most high Yahweh hates, man. And guess what? Don't I hate them that hate thee, O Lord? You know what I mean? These people, these hate. You, you can look around, man. You can look around. These people hate the most high. These people hate Yahweh. You look around, man. He's pushing his whole uh, uh, um, homosexual agenda. Now they're doing it on the children. Now you got Dwayne Wade's son. That's not a little girl, man. That's a boy. That's a male child, man. And he's about to be a, a man soon. Matter of fact, he is a man, man. That's what they're pushing. All love this and all love that. These people really hate the most high, man. Right? They're going against everything he said not to do. They don't give land a rest for seven years. The sky's polluted with chemtrails. The water's polluted with fluoride. Look what, look what they did to the children of the Most High. The real children of the Most High. You real Jews, you so-called Negroes. You're the real Jews of the Bible, man. The real Israelites, you so-called Puerto Rican, so-called Cuban, so-called Mexican, so-called Native American Indians, so-called Seminole Indians. You are the real chosen people. And look what they're doing to you. You in the slums, the ghettos, the bodegas, res reservations. You're homeless. All right? It's one-sided, everything against you. You can't win for losing. All right? This is not your kingdom. We, we, we under punishment right now. But soon we about to be released from that. You know what I'm saying? Malachi 1 and 3. The burden of the word of the... Zalakia. The burden of the word... Of the Lord to Israel. Wait, hold on, why I'm at Malachi. One of them, I think I'm Malachi. Matter of fact, let me. Oh, yeah, I'm right here. Oh, yeah, this is it. I'm tripping. It's like you. The burden of the word of the Lord to Israel by Malachi. I have loved you, said the Lord. Yet ye say, Wherein hast thou loved us? Was not Esau Jacob's brother, said the Lord? Yet I love Jacob and I hated Esau. And Esau. You saw Edom is not done away with. This motherfucker jogging right here past me. They right here in this city where I'm at. They in your city. They all over the planet touching shit. And when I say touching, I'm talking about conquering, stealing, rape, robbing, and murdering. You heard me? Shedding innocent blood. People that's not even bothering them in other countries. They going over there and putting sanctions on their land. Telling them what to do and what not to do. You know what I'm saying? Put us in slavery and went overboard on what they were supposed to do. The Lord put us in their hand, they went overboard, man. You know? Buck breaking men, raping little boys, taking a mom that's pregnant, ripping, ripping her stomach apart and taking a baby out, man. Burning people alive, lynchings, hanging them, man, cutting their feet off, cutting their ride off and all that. This is why the Lord hates the Edomites, man. 
is some of the reasons why Yahweh hates these people. And when you go to Obadiah, he's going to obliterate them. They're, gonna, they're not going to exist no more after they, uh, after they serve their time in slavery, man. You heard me? The Lord don't care about these other nations. He don't care about these people. He only loves Yasha Allah, the Prince of Power. Yasha Allah, Israel, man. All right? You. Okay, let me read that again. And then I'm going to get the Apocrypha and be out. Malachi 1 and 2. I have loved you, said Yahweh. Yet ye say, wherein hast thou loved us? Was not Esau Jacob's brother, said the Lord? Yet I loved Jacob, and I hated Esau, and laid his mountains and his heritage waste for the dragons of, of the wilderness. God. So the Lord is going to take this man out of power. Alright? The Lord is going to take this man and throw all this down, man. All of this. And this is how you know the Lord don't care about these other people, man. Come on a second, that's just where you at, baby. Uh, 6 and 56, y'all know where I'm going at. <laughs> 6 and 56. Oh, no, I'm way in the back, man. Bear with me, Salah. Salah, yeah. 56, I think it's 50. Oh, here it is, Khan. Khan, my pocket for all two up, man. Uh, the second is a 6 and 56. Wait, let me make sure it's 6 first. All right, here it go. Second is 6 and 56. As for the other people which also come of Adam. All right, you know what it's going at. You know I mean? As for the other people, we know who the other people is, the other nations, the so-called Chinese, the so-called Vietnamese, uh, the so-called Russians, the so-called, uh, I mean, uh, so-called, uh, what are they, what are, damn, what are, what are these people, man? The so-called Red Dot Indians, Elon, et cetera. These are the people, the other nations, man. All right, listen to this. As for the other people which also come of Adam, thou hast said that they are nothing. They are nothing, man. The so called white man, nothing. The so called China man, nothing. That's what it's saying here. You remember? This, this, the, this the Bible, man. This is not me speaking, even though I agree with it. <laughs> I agree with it, you heard me? A trillion percent. You heard me? Let me put my right hand up. A trillion percent, you hear me? For seriously. So it says, as for the other people, which also come of Adam, because don't they come from Adam too? Don't they come from Adam? Yeah, they do, man. But the Lord, the Lord have his favorites. Who he, who he dealing with and who he not dealing with. <laughs> and someone walking behind me right now. You know what I'm saying? Uh... It says, that be the spirit too. That be the spirit. <laughs> it says, hold on, why man? All right, second, Ezra 6 and 56. As for the other people which come from Adam, thou hast said that they are nothing, but be like unto spittle. So spittle is saliva. Once you spit that saliva out, you're not going to go back and get it and be like, oh my God, my saliva, no. You're, you're, gonna, <laughs> you, you're spitting it out for a reason. Because it's nothing. You hear me? It is nothing. Like them that just walk by, it's nothing. All right? As for the other people which also come from Adam, thou hast said that they are nothing, but be like unto spittle, and has likened the abundance of them unto a drop that falleth from a vessel. So when you spit, when you spit, it's saliva that's removed from the mouth. You know what I'm saying? When, 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 if you got a, you got a bucket, you got a bucket of water, you got a bucket of water, and a little piece of that water, that little piece of that water falls out of the bucket, you're not gonna go back and soap it up with a sponge. Oh. You're not gonna go back and get that water, man. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So the Lord basically saying these other people, these other nations, He don't give a flying fiddle about them. You know what I'm saying? They just playing a part in the movie. You got the steak and the potatoes. And the asparagus. 
What you gonna go for first on that plate? The steak, you hear me? <laughs> we the steak, we the salt, we the wave. We on time, man. So the Lord hates. You hear me? There's no way around it. You can't maneuver your way out of it. You can't dodge it. You can't dodge it like Floyd. None of that. No, uh-uh. You're gonna get all these licks, man. You hear me? So the Lord hate these other nations. And the Lord love Israel. And they'll try to flip it around on that Mormon doctrine talking about, well, you 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 the devil, y'all black. Black people the devil. They the, they the curse of Ham. No, man, we come from the line of Shem. You heard me? Through your how about Shem, y'all was shy, man. You heard me? We the real deal. Lord, when that was edifying, man. Call Haloyim, Wahawala, Yahweh, Shem, Yahweh, Shalom, 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 Sh